Vitamin B5 Pantothenic Acid Pantothenic Acid, Vitamin B5, also called Pantothenic Acid, is one of eight B vitamins. All B vitamins help the body convert food, carbohydrates, into fuel glucose, which the body uses to produce energy. These B vitamins, often referred to as B complex vitamins, also help the body use fats and protein. B complex vitamins are needed for healthy skin, hair, eyes, and liver. They also help the nervous system function properly. All B vitamins are water soluble, meaning that the body does not store them. In addition to playing a role in the breakdown of fats and carbohydrates for energy, vitamin B5 is critical to the manufacture of red blood cells, as well as sex and stress-related hormones produced in the adrenal glands, small glands that sit atop the kidneys. Vitamin B5 is also important in maintaining a healthy digestive tract, and it helps the body use other vitamins, particularly B2 also called riboflavin, it is sometimes called the anti-stress vitamin, but there is no concrete evidence whether it helps the body withstand stress. Your body needs pantothenic acid to synthesize cholesterol. A derivative of pantothenic acid called pantothene is being studied to see if it may help lower cholesterol levels in the body. Vitamin B5 deficiency is rare, but may include symptoms such as fatigue, insomnia, depression, irritability, vomiting, stomach pains, burning feet, and upper respiratory infections. High cholesterol, high triglycerides. Several small, double-blind studies suggest that pantothene may help reduce triglycerides, or fats, in the blood in people who have high cholesterol. Some of these studies show that pantothene helped lower LDL bad cholesterol and raise HDL good cholesterol. In some open studies, pantothene seems to lower levels of cholesterol and triglycerides in people with diabetes. But not all studies agree. Larger studies are needed to see whether pantothene has any real benefit. Skin care and wound healing. Preliminary research suggests that vitamin B5 has moisturizing effects on the skin. However, researchers aren't clear why it works. Other studies, mostly in test tubes and animals, but a few on people, suggest that vitamin B5 supplements may speed wound healing, especially following surgery. This may be particularly true if vitamin B5 is combined with vitamin C. Rheumatoid Arthritis Preliminary evidence suggests that pantothenic acid might improve symptoms of rheumatoid arthritis. Raw, but the evidence is weak. One study found that people with raw may have lower levels of B5 in their blood than healthy people, and the lowest levels were associated with the most severe symptoms. Other studies show that calcium pantothenate improves symptoms of raw, include Dietary sources Pantothenic acid gets its name from the Greek root pantos, meaning everywhere, because it is available in a wide variety of foods. However, the vitamin B5 in foods is lost during processing. Fresh meats, vegetables, and whole unprocessed grains have more vitamin B5 than refined, canned, and frozen food. The best sources are brewer's yeast, corn, cauliflower, kale, broccoli, tomatoes, avocado, legumes, lentils, egg yolks, beef especially organ meats such as liver and kidney, turkey, duck, chicken, milk, split peas, peanuts, soybeans, sweet potatoes, sunflower seeds, 
whole grain breads and cereals, lobster, wheat germ and salmon. Available forms. Vitamin B5 can be found in multivitamins and B-complex vitamins, or sold separately under the names pantothenic acid and calcium pantothenate. It is available in a variety of forms, including tablets, soft gulls, and capsules. Precautions Because of the potential for side effects and interactions with medications, you should take dietary supplements only under the supervision of a knowledgeable health care provider. Doctors consider vitamin B5 safe at doses equal to the daily intake and at moderately higher doses. Very high doses may cause diarrhea and may increase the risk of bleeding. Pregnant and breastfeeding women should not exceed the daily adequate intake unless directed by their doctor. Vitamin B5 should be taken with water, preferably after eating. Taking any one of the B vitamins for a long period of time can result in an imbalance of other important B vitamins. For this reason, you may want to take a B complex vitamin which includes all the B vitamins. Possible interactions. If you are being treated with any of the following medications, you should not use vitamin B5 supplements without first talking to your health care provider. Antibiotics. Tetracycline. Vitamin B5 interferes with the absorption and effectiveness of the antibiotic. Tetracycline, you should take B vitamins at different times from tetracycline. All vitamin B complex supplements act in this way and should be taken at different times from tetracycline. Drugs to treat Alzheimer's disease, vitamin B5 may increase the effects of a group of drugs called cholinesterase inhibitors which are used to treat Alzheimer's disease that might lead to severe side effects. You should not take these drugs with B5 unless under a doctor's supervision. Cholinesterase inhibitors include donepezil recept, memantine hydrochloride epixa, galantamine reminol, rivastigium exelon. Since high doses of vitamin B5 can increase bleeding, you should take extra care if you take blood thinning medications such as warfarin, coumadine, aspirin, and others. Safety As for safety, the IOM sets tolerable upper intake levels for vitamins and minerals when evidence is sufficient. In the case of pantothenic acid, there is no UL as there is no human data for adverse effects from high doses. The EFSA also reviewed the safety question and reached the same conclusion as in United States, that there was not sufficient evidence to set a UL for pantothenic acid. Deficiency Pantothenic acid deficiency in humans is very rare and has not been thoroughly studied. In the few cases where deficiency has been seen prisoners of war during World War II, victims of starvation, or limited volunteer trials, nearly all symptoms were reversed with orally administered pantothenic acid. Symptoms of deficiency are similar to other vitamin B deficiencies. There is impaired energy production due to low car levels which could cause symptoms of irritability, fatigue, and apathy. Acetylcholine synthesis is also impaired. Therefore, neurological symptoms can also appear in deficiency. They include sensation of numbness in hands and feet, paresthesia and muscle cramps. Additional symptoms could include restlessness, malaise, sleep disturbances, nausea, vomiting and abdominal cramps in animals. Symptoms include disorders of the nervous, gastrointestinal, and immune systems. 
reduced growth rate, decreased food intake, skin lesions and changes in hair coat, and alterations in lipid and carbohydrate metabolism, dot in rodents. There can be loss of hair color, which led to marketing of pantothenic acid as a dietary supplement, which could prevent or treat graying of hair in humans, despite the lack of any human trial evidence. Pantothenic acid status can be assessed by measuring either whole blood concentration or 24-hour urinary excretion. In humans, whole blood values less than 1 mmol per liter are considered low, as is urinary excretion of less than 4.56 mol day. Vitamin B5 and health. Because pantothenic acid helps to break down fats, it has been studied for a potential role in reducing cholesterol levels in people who have dyslipidemia. This is a condition in which there is an abnormally high concentration of fat or lipids in the blood e.g. LDL bad cholesterol, triglycerides, and low levels of HDL good cholesterol. Low levels of COM may prevent the breakdown and clearance of fats in the blood. It has also been proposed that pantothenic acid may have an antioxidant effect that reduces low-grade inflammation, which is present in the early stages of heart disease however. Research in this area is still limited. And it is unclear if pantothenic acid supplements can lower blood fats independently of or enhance the cholesterol-lowering effects of eating a heart-healthy diet. A double-blinded randomized trial following 216 men and women with moderate dyslipidemia were given. Supplements of 400 mg COA or 600 mg pantothene daily for 8 weeks. Pantothene is another form of pantothenic acid that has been studied to control dyslipidemia. The participants were also counseled on a cholesterol-lowering diet. After eight weeks, the COA group had a 33% reduction in triglycerides compared with baseline levels. Total cholesterol also decreased, and HDL cholesterol increased from baseline. The pantothene group showed smaller reductions in total cholesterol and triglycerides. No negative side effects from the supplements were observed. This information is collected from different places and is only an informative video for you and not a treatment method. Every day, there will be a new video please subscribe so as not to miss.